Welcome to In 5 Minutes. The agenda of this clip is to find the expression of VIH for my CMOS inverter. We have already seen in the previous clip of a CMOS inverter where we identified the region of operation for my NMOS and PMOS transistors for different set of inputs. While doing that, we saw that when my input is equal to VIH, my NMOS transistor operates in linear region and my PMOS transistor operates in saturation region. We have already seen this in the previous clips. We also know that the current flowing through the PMOS is going to be equal to the current flowing through the NMOS for the simple reason that we are studying the static characteristics and there is no change in the output voltage. So the current across the output capacitor is zero. So IDP is equal to IDN. And we know the regions of operation, so we'll write the equations of linear and saturation currents and identify the value of VIH. So let's write the equation of ID for NMOS in linear region first. Kn by 2 twice Vg for NMOS, so N suffix minus Vt into Vds, again N because of NMOS, minus Vds square equal to Kp by 2 because it's a PMOS. VGSP minus VTP the whole square. So now let's substitute the corresponding values of VGS and VDS into the equation. So for an NMOS, my VGS is nothing but, if you see on the left hand side of the screen, it's nothing but VN minus VT. VDS for an NMOS is nothing but V out minus V out square equal to Kp by 2 Vgs for a PMOS is nothing but Vn minus Vdd minus Vtp the whole square. Now we know that VIH is a point on my voltage transfer characteristics where my slope is equal to minus 1. It means that my dV out by dV in is equal to minus 1. So let's differentiate this equation. Let's call this equation a star. Let's differentiate the star equation with respect to V in and then we'll substitute dV out by dV in equal to minus 1. Let's first do the differentiation. Differentiating with respect to V in. Which is nothing but the following. Kn V in minus Vt because it's an NMOS suffix n. dV out by dV in plus V out minus V out into dV out by dV in equal to Kp, that's correct, V in minus Vdb minus Vtp. Now we'll substitute dV out by dV in equal to minus 1 and we'll also substitute V in equal to VIH because we are trying to identify the value of VIH. And let's rewrite this equation. That is nothing but Kn dV out by dV in is minus 1. Remember that. So this is minus of VIH plus VTN plus twice V out equal to closing the bracket Kp VIH minus VDD minus VTP. Now we have the equation in terms of VIH and V out, let's rearrange the term and find the corresponding value of VIH. So VIH equal to VDD plus VTP for PMOS plus KR twice V out plus VTN special voltage for an NMOS upon 1 plus KR where Kr is nothing but Kn by Kp and let's call this equation as double star. If you see the equation star and double star, you will come to know that both these equations have two unknowns, V in which is nothing but VIH and V out. So if we solve both these equations simultaneously, we will get the correct value of VIH and we will also find the value of the output voltage V out when my input is VIH. 
Hope you have understood how to find the expression for VIH. In the next clip, we'll be studying the expression for switching threshold. Hope you have understood. Stay tuned. Thank you.